Hello everyone and welcome to my channel and another video about our PEBC OSCE preparation course. Today's case is about an eye case and this is one of the popular cases you might get in the OSCEs um, uh, that you, you might actually get in different ways and I'm going to explain in a minute. Um, so for those of you who are new here, thanks for joining the channel um, and for those who, are, who haven't joined yet, this channel is all about clinical pharmacy practice. I teach you how to become clinical pharmacists, how to pass the OSCE exam and I also uh, have a chapter about immigration to Canada. So if you're interested in any of these topics, make sure to subscribe to the channel and hopefully you uh, can get to join one of my courses on the channel. Now let's get started with today's presentation and as usual I like to give you a few tips on how to solve such cases with ease um, and how to save time in your OSCE exam and one of the things that will save you a lot of time are the red flags so if you ask a few questions to the uh, the actor or actress and the OSCE exam um, they are trained uh, to answer some of these questions uh, which are very important ones and uh, if you're able to eliminate the red flags then you would know that this case is probably uh, going to be a counseling case that you're going to have to recommend a product from the table in front of you and counsel the patient on it however if you ask these questions to the to the patient the actor and uh, and the answer yes for any of them then you know for sure from the beginning of the case that this is going to be a referral uh, a referral case to the doctor so you're going to refer this patient to the doctor and you're not going to recommend any drugs and a lot of courses out there don't teach you that and this is actually a very important tip that i'd like to teach uh, my students and my uh, uh, followers and uh, and here in this case uh, or uh, in, the, in the eye uh, problem case in general any eye problem case uh, these are the red flags that when you see, you have to refer the patient to a doctor. Do not recommend any over-the-counter product for those patients because it may not work and it may actually worsen the, uh, the problem. And uh, one, the first one I have on my list here is the severe pain. If the patient is complaining with severe pain, that is not something that you would treat uh, with an over-the-counter eye drop. Um, this definitely requires a referral to the doctor, especially if the pain was um, abrupt, uh, sudden pain that uh, is unexplainable. The second one on my list is the photophobia. Uh, if the patient complains of unable to open their eyes uh, in the sun, or in light, in bright light, um, uh, and, and, and feeling some sort of discomfort when they come into contact with bright light, that uh, probably could be either a side effect of their medications or maybe some other uh, disorder of the eye and, and will require uh, referral to the doctor. Now, there are about eight or ten um, red flags that we're going to go through really quickly, but they are super easy to memorize and I really want you to memorize them before you go uh, for your OSCE exam. Um, 